the asteroid 2012 DA-14 flying by the Earth Friday afternoon at 2.30 East Coast time flies so far away, more than 17,000 miles from the Earth, that no one on Earth is in danger, nor will any of our satellites be hurt or damaged. NASA has an extensive program that surveys the skies using ground-based telescopes and space-based telescopes to look for near-Earth objects. And we find these all the time, and we study them, we look at their orbits, and we determine if they're potentially hazardous or not. The planetary scientists are really excited about this passage of DA-14 uh, by the Earth because as it flies by, we're going to use our radars to bounce radio waves off this asteroid, watch it spin, look at the reflections and understand its size, its shape, and perhaps even a little bit about what it's made of. Near-Earth objects that NASA's been studying do fly close to the Earth. Uh, this particular one is flying fairly close, and once again, it's, we're at a very safe distance and allows us to study it in greater detail. But this happens uh, only once in several months. NASA is currently uh, studying about 9,000 of these near-Earth asteroids. About 1,800 of them are, are fairly large, and those are very, of a very particular interest to us. We study their orbital motions, and we understand where they'll be extrapolated well, in it, well into the future. The near-Earth objects, these asteroids that come by us that we see today, uh, actually originate in the asteroid belt. We have a mission called Dawn that's been in the asteroid belt now more than a year, studying some of the largest asteroids around. These are important objects because they are fundamental building blocks of planets. So by studying asteroids, we see what the early composition and the early uh, accretion material of our early solar system that builds up and creates planets. There's a very exciting event coming up uh, today. 2012 DA-14 is going to do a close flyby to the Earth at a distance of about 17,000 miles. The good news is that the Earth is safe, the International Space Station is safe, and all of our satellite assets are safe. NASA has an extensive near-Earth observation program that's been scanning the skies for well over a decade to catalog the most potentially hazardous asteroids and to assess their impact threat. This has been a phenomenally successful program and we've retired the majority of risk associated with an asteroid impact in the near future. You know, the flyby of asteroid 2012 DA-14 is a historic event. Never before in human history have we been able to see an object come this close of this size. Uh, this is a, a tribute to uh, the phenomenal success of our asteroid observation programs. We've been scanning the skies for well over a decade to catalog these objects. We're able to predict their orbits well into the future and get ready for this phenomenal scientific event.